The other thing about Windsor is uh, actually right where Box Turtle Lane is, there used to be a dirt road and there was a fellow that lived there named George Ritchie. He used to come over and cut our hair when I was a little kid and he used to work on his car at my folks house. The group my parents were in on Kennedy Road, my parents were the youngest ones there and they had a, they called it the, I think they called it the, the Windsor Men's and Ladies Club. They used to get together every month and play cards and stuff. And uh, I can remember all these, these old guys and it's Uncle Joey and Uncle Walt and, Uncle, you know, all these people that were nice and were part of it. And uh, George Ritchie used to always, he didn't have any children, but he always used to complain about how bad they would be. And they'd be borrowing my cigarettes and they'd do this and they'd do that. And then we used to go get together from time to time and go out to Stratton Book, Brook and go swimming. And I can remember probably being four or five years old and whining to my father that I had to go to the, go to the bathroom. And I mean, they were way, way, way down there for a little kid. And Uncle George picked me up, threw me on his shoulders and said, let's go, the, the mean old guy. But he, he was nice. And the other thing is he always talked about, he was, he was, I think an eighth Native American and he always used to tell me stories. And he said, right along the Farmington River, half a mile north of Breakneck is where there's an Indian graveyard. And I've never been there, but I know, I know where it is. And I think the state might have done some excavating there. Um, but there's stuff all around. There's, there's arrowheads everywhere. It, it's neat.